Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel, if you're new here, hi hello my name's Lydia and I make mental health videos here on YouTube pretty much every single day. I posted a tweet earlier on where I was talking about how my personality changes depending on who I'm with and how I can change very depending on the circumstances I find myself in and I thought this would be a bit of a interesting video to share with you guys. Don't let me try So what I decided to do is that every time that I'm doing something different or I feel different in myself I'm going to film a little introduction clip as to how I am, what I'm feeling and what my thoughts are at that exact time. I think that's the way me going to be like, what the, the, the title of this video is, meet all of me. So this is me as a whole. The way BPD works is takes these little tiny fragments of our personality and puts them into little tiny bubbles and you basically pick the pick the bubbles you want for when you are with this certain person. But that's the way I visualise it anyway, other people use different visualisation techniques, that's just the one I use. So yeah, I am Lydia, I'm 21 and I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. I've been half asleep all day and I'm extremely fatigued at the moment. Yeah. And then I found out I was in hospital and my body is generally more fatigued um, when I've been experiencing mania and then crashing and what we're in at the moment we're in a bit of a numb phase like I don't really feel excited, I don't feel happy, I don't feel sad, I just feel sleepy I feel fucking horrible at the moment I feel like it's all one thing after the other, after the other, after the other going wrong there is only so much people can take when it's stuff like this. Like, there's only so much, like, I can do to keep myself going before I fall apart. You know, I'm a real fucking person with real emotions. And all this medical stuff today is just, it's just been too much. Like, it's so hard to explain. It's so fucking hard. I want my brain to be quiet. I want the thought to stop racing around. I want it to be just organised and straight and simple. I'm so sick of everything being all down, black and white. I'm sick of it. Like, I can be all together. I can just sit and make videos. I can stay and do things. I can talk. I can be happy around people. And in reality, like, internally, I'm just like so done with it all. I'm so done. My emotions are very out of control at the moment. That's what I want to talk about today. If I don't want to do it sitting down, I want to go out for a bit. And, well, hey, why don't I go over to like London Bridge area? So, let's head out, guys. What's going on you like? Hi, how's it going? I oh, sound really weird. I sound really weird like this. Uh, I, just, I just got back from the gym. Those of you who don't know, I go to the gym in my building it's like three, four times a week. Uh, yeah, and I'm doing this little video where I basically introduce like my personality at the moment. I'm like, go, go, go. We need to go work harder. I'm feeling you know, like I really want to push myself and do more things. I'm just do this shit, you know? Like, let's fucking go. Can I eat myself into the bed? Bang down. Shot me. They shot me down. Bang bang. I just went out to the supermarket and. What was I doing? Uh, functioning brain, why aren't you working? I picked up the cam for a reason. <laughs> Memory loss of mental illness. <laughs> um, no, what's wrong? Oh shit, yeah, the meat me thing. The meat. I'm absolutely exhausted. I just feel so, so fatigued. I, I don't even. I haven't moved since I yeeted myself onto the bed. Like, I just haven't. I just can't. I just have the energy to. What a water bottle. I just want came in. Yeah. Ugh. Literally don't want to 
because I'm comfy. But I'm also not comfy, and my back's in a really weird position, and it hurts. But These were like, oh, you can't, you've got the energy to your camera. My camera was literally resting on my forehead. Like, <laughs> I don't think people get how bad pretty can actually be. Like, I'm, I'm fucking exhausted. Like, <laughs> I look pathetic, but I just don't have the energy to, like, get up and move and whatever, so... Chances are, I'm probably gonna kick the, the light with my foot and uh, I'll end up sleeping like this because my, I'm tired. I need to have my meds. They're just like, yeah, they're, like, they're just there. I, don't, I keep my medication on my bed. I'm about to dive into a world that I never thought of doing. Never! <laughs> I'm vlogging this, I'm not going to release it for fuck knows how long, but today is, what, what day is it? The 20th of October, and I don't even know why, I'm literally watching YouTube, I'm doing nothing basically, and I just got an idea, I was like, why don't I try and make a makeup brand? Why the fuck not? Like, I, I'm into makeup, and... I've just been like designing like logos and looking into how you actually start a brand and if I ever find out who sent me this I will literally thank you forever because I got sent this in the mail it was on my Amazon wish list and someone ordered it me back in the summer and I love stuffed animals I don't know it brings me back to happy memories in my childhood and don't really have many of them running around my head, so um, if you did want to send me something, I have an Amazon gift list thing open. It's the only way I can do like a PO box thing. It's not the same, but you know, you know, um, it is what it is. Um, the address is associated with that, so if you click onto the list, you can actually see the delivery address of which to get mail to me, you can send, you don't have to buy me anything Hamas and you can she send me a letter and I'll be so happy. I've got so much anxiety about this time to make my appointment. Just because <laughs> I've been struggling <laughs> and I, I don't end up in hospital again. I couldn't do that ward again. I couldn't do that fucking hospital again. They treat me horribly. So this is like the, the meat all of me video, it's just because I, I, my personality is so <laughs> weird, like I, I act differently, very differently depending on how I feel and I thought this video would be, I don't know, it's probably not, but you know, yeah, this is the me that's relieved after being annoyed. <laughs> I was annoyed because they um, screwed up my prescription, thank you home treatment team. And then my GP fixed it. Yay! Do, 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 do. I'm still debating going against Central. Now, I want to go into Central London and film, but I'm also like, I want to sleep. That's all I want. All I want is to sleep. You know? And just have a chill. But, you know. But no, my prescriptions have been resolved, so. It's one less thing to think about. So now I'm pretty chill at the moment. I won't do anything today either. I've literally been in bed all day. All day. Apart from when the home treatment team came, I got out of bed for that. I wasn't awake. <laughs> I, was, I was just falling asleep. Like I just couldn't, couldn't sleep, which is fine. But even still, shouldn't do anything. Like, I'm paying to do a degree. Why didn't I go in? Because I didn't want to bother. I'm trying to get a call on me. I'm trying to do a 
struggle and like oh i want to get videos because i don't get videos and i put up like i put up three videos like within 24 hours i'm done a two hour live stream and i'm still going but slightly more tired now i don't know i don't know this me all of my videos like it's different for me like it's not what i usually try and do because I usually try and merge things and keep it all understandable but like this is just how my brain functions in a different way because my head works in a different way definition of mental illness <laughs> I'm in such a weird mood at the moment like I've gone from being raging angry on a live stream to Oh, when's my phone gonna die? Because my phone's been on 1% for a hot minute. I don't even live that far from the pharmacy. Why am I moaning about it? Like, in theory, it's in my room. It, it should be the hardest part of it. But then you realise something. It's my room. And I'm not the tidiest of human beings. And I, when I'm out of it, I think of really, like, weird things. I'm just like, oh my god, that would be so clever. And, never fucking remember so it's just very that's like dissociation for two <laughs> like you'll do something you'll think oh my god it's really clever do it remember it for a bit then a week later you're just like why the fuck did i put it um, um... <laughs> my back hurts anyway I'm gonna charge my phone and then go and film a video. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get out tonight. <laughs> and if I do go out, it will almost definitely end very badly. And I don't want that. I'm seeing the home treatment team in the morning. Um, I got this video shows very accurately what life with BPD is actually like versus what people think it is. It's so much more than just intense emotions. It's such a complicated mental illness and if I manage to break that stigma with this then it's done something. It's not what I wanted it to be. It's not as, it's not got as much as I wish it had but my safety comes above YouTube. It always has and it always will. So with that, I am going to end this video here. I hope you have learned something from this. And if you are going through something similar, reach out to those who can support you. I myself am contacting the home treatment team in a minute because, like I said, my thoughts aren't great right now. Which in itself isn't a problem but it's a problem it's i've put myself in a situation that i don't want to be in that i shouldn't be in i shouldn't even be able to be in this position that i'm in right now and i don't want to go into detail on this as much as i want to go out and film i don't feel safe going out to film so i'm not going to um I want to say thank you to those of you who have supported me through this and just know that I'm okay and that I'll be okay, things will resolve, things will work out and I'll be back to be my bubbly self in no time. <laughs> Believe me, that's life with BPD, your, your emotions are just so unpredictable and unstable that you, you really can go from this to anything really. It's, I've been filming for four minutes, this is supposed to be a really short ending clip. Uh, I'm gonna shut the fuck up and... I'm very dissociated right now. Just trying to regulate the breathing and ground myself. That's what the blinking's about. I, I always do it when I get like this. I feel 
calm and feel more relaxed. Okay. Lower as pal. Right. Don't let me drown Don't let me drown